Hey there everyone, I'm Valky Fenoit, and welcome back to more Button Kaitos, Eternal Wings, and The Last Ocean. And Callus, turn around. Don't turn your back to our viewers, that's not nice of you. <laughs> Last time, we entered a book. A very repetitive and boring book. It's like reading The Order of the Phoenix. <laughs> oh come on, that book was actually, that was by far the most boring of the Harry Potter books. And the movie was worse. Sure, I could not watch it. <laughs> Sorry if you like it, but my opinion. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a part of Shallow Side Quest. I actually forgot what 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 I was saying, but yeah. Anyway, today we are gonna finish this place, so let's just move on. And this is the part that I'm going with. So let's go. Is it gonna be more flashback though? I can't really remember. Oh, not again. I hate deja vu. <laughs> <sighs> They're testing me. Using the ancient book of magic as bait to see if I'm really ready. Ah, I see. Well, you're as ready as can be. My book. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny because we are inside a book. <laughs> oh, Callus, you crack me up. What, Callus cracked me up? We all decided to stop Melodia Malpertio long ago. Some for others. Callus. <laughs> oh. Flashback time! Great. Barnett tells me the time of the prophecy is drawing near. Something somewhere is awakening after a thousand years of sleep. Below just that old? Huh. I know, I know. The time may be here for the last of the Ice Queens to fulfill her destiny. Whether it be you or I. Not you. Should the prophecy be fulfilled, the Ice Queen will be no more. What? It will be our final prayer to the world. Our final blessing. I like the aurora in the background. Very nice. Shilla, you must follow your own path. Even if you are alone, never back down. Never fear. And stride forward with your head up. The ocean will always be with you. And we will always be walking alongside. What was that all about? Eh, probably nothing important. Ah, oh, finally. A different looking room. I would never guess that we would see it. Is this it? The ancient and forbidden book of magic. The real one. The real book inside the other book. Bookception. Great. How will those energy be coming out of this book? Something be seen. Inside. Yeah, we are. Technically. Yeah, I don't even know anymore. Are you gonna unleash it? Are you sure that's such a bright idea, Shella? Can't be worse than Malpertio anyway. I promised my mother that I'd never back down, never fear. Never surrender, never give up. That I'd stride forward with my head up. Don't really know what I was going with that. The heck? Oh, crap. Darkness. Huh? People! Transparent people. 
Greetings. Are you the last of the Ice Queens? Ahem. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry? <coughs> yes. Most likely. Has the time come? <sighs> then let us begin. A thousand years ago, a seed of hope was sown by our hand. Let us witness the fruit it has borne. So they're gonna test Shella by throwing the most ferocious monster ever at her. A monster so powerful that it's gonna devour everything in this world. It is even gonna... <laughs> Dragon. Oh man, oh man. Uh, wow, I really botched that combo, didn't I? <laughs> oh man, oh man. It's a Saber Dragon. Really? Really? The Saber, <laughs> the Saber Dragon, really? Hooey! Oh, I needed that. Uh, I can't even remember this guy's name. He is that pathetic. It's Cole Cobrun or something like that. I don't really know. This guy is pathetic. He... Oh my god. Oh, my heart hurt. <laughs> I laugh too much. This guy... Oh my god. He... I, I guess you can say it's a little bit symbolic, you know? That, uh, remember way back in the beginning, the Saber Dragon killed Shella's uh, guardians, Graham and Leon. And now the, uh, the boss in this place is pretty much the Saber Dragon 2.0. But then again, it's the Saber Dragon 2.0. And he is just as pathetic as the Saber Dragon. Look at this! The enemies in this dungeon did more damage than he did. This is pathetic! And... Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm, I must say though, he does get a uh, attack later on when he's weak. That is a little bit annoying, but... <laughs> it's really nothing bad. Why is this a boss at the end of the game? I... I don't even know. Let's see, I'm gonna use this on Shella just to boost her attack, I think. And he is 80% weak to win. Gibari and Shella is gonna wreck this guy. The only reason I have Kalos with me, really, is... <laughs> I don't even know. He got some win elemental attacks, that's all. I... It's just... Wow. Perfect example of a boss that is placed in the wrong place in the game. I don't really know where I would put this guy, but it's certainly not this late in the game. Hell no. <sighs> oh, wow, he did a little bit more this time. Still nothing big though. God, this guy's pathetic and oh god. Yesterday's wine. <laughs> ah, I wanted to. Oh, well, chaotic illusion. Oh man, I saw what I what I would get afterwards, and I will probably do a little bit more damage than this. I got another wind elemental sword. <laughs> ah, well, still not bad. Let's see. I just wish Shella wasn't confused. I know. Let's see. Pretty stupid of me to say, since I did equip the uh, skull anklet on her. Well, and I, well knowing that she would get confused, but it would be nice if she wasn't confused against this guy. She would wreck him. 
She could solo this guy if she wanted. You see, he's already weak. Oh my god, this guy is pathetic. <laughs> oh, I think I haven't laughed this much since. This is the last time I play this game and I fought him. <laughs> oh. Good lord. Please kill him now, this would be hilarious. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, that would be hilarious if Gibar actually killed him there. <laughs> uh, oh, well. He is really not far from dying anyway, so... Whew! Oh, he got a longer combo now, it seems. Oh. Oh. Let's see. Dark Implosion. Cool. Yeah, that will heal him with the same amount of damage he does to you. 800 is really nothing special, so... <laughs> I stand by my case to saying this guy is pathetic! Oh god. Well, it's been a while since we've seen any of Kalos' Wind Elemental finishers. Even though we already... We just have one right now. <laughs> we don't have uh, Blue Storm anymore, so... It would be kind of hard to get any of the others. <laughs> and that was it. Fitting that Shella killed him with one attack. <laughs> Considering the Saber Dragon killed Rugrab and Leon with one attack. <laughs> I'm so grasping at straws right now. It's insane. <laughs> The world is in your hands. Act with wisdom. I will. Your will and your hope reside in me now. Last of the Ice Queens. Why are they saying last? Is it... Can you, can you not get a child, Chella? Hmm. Oh well. We, pl we will probably find out a little bit later. Probably nothing important though. And of course by defeating Kulka Baron. Kulka Baron. Okay. We get another Galios Fang for Savina. Very nice. And a Aqua Burst level 6. But no finisher. Interesting. A lot of water stuff though. Hmm. Of course we also get Shella's level 8 finisher, Seal of Water, which is perfect for her, because it's also it also fits very well with the elemental setup I have for her. But not only that, Seal of Water have a very, very awesome second effect. 100% chance of death. I love this finisher. <laughs> But also, damn, level 6 Aqua Burst. Heck yeah! Let's see, do I have any level 3 I can kick out? Or actually, I'm gonna go and class up Shell, I think, and then put it in their deck afterwards. But yeah, with that, we have done all of the personal side quests. So, what is the next thing for us to do? Well, we still haven't given the animals to the Lady in Wasson. And uh, we still haven't gotten all the family members from Incusmus family, so next time we are gonna finish off the family tree side quest. And I will I'll admit it actually feels very, very nice to be able to say that. Let's see how many we have left. We have five more. And those are actually pretty easy to get now. So, yeah, next time, this family tree is going to be full. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, I thank you all for watching, and I see you all then.